So this video is going to shift your mind and give you the best advice to help you get some of your first recruiting clients and get them consistently. Hey all, I'm just starting out as a recruitment agency in Australia and finding it really challenging developing business. Can anybody help with suggestions on at least getting regular meetings with potential clients? Here are three approaches recruiters do to get clients. Number one is automation. So you set email or LinkedIn automation and there's a six to eight message sequence pitching your recruiting services. And here's the big detail is imagine yourself in a room with 50 or 100 other agencies and this company walks in, a potential client. They're looking around and they're like, let's pick out like five or six to add to our arsenal. Why would they pick to work with you? It's either going to be one of these three things, expertise and speed grouped together, differentiation or cost. So expertise and speed, it comes from being in the space for a while. It usually means you work faster as well. You know what you're doing. Two is differentiation. Do you offer a different way to get candidates? Three is cost. I'm a huge believer if you don't offer expertise or differentiation and you're not using approach number two, which is coming up, which is what 95% of the most successful people do, you have to win at cost. Offer 10%, hell, even like 5%. If you have to work for free, just get some wins, gain some experience for your future. And even that client who is paying less, once they see that you have figured it out, they're going to be willing to give you at least close to market price at 20% if they know that you can take care of business. So real quick, we dive deeper into all of this stuff in the membership and Patreon, a screen share, answer all your questions. There's courses and I show you exactly what you need to do to build your agency. All of it's linked below and at recruiterrocket.io. All right, number two, the number two playbook. We we can call it is take an action so in any sales role i've ever had either myself or a marketing team was setting that linkedin automation that the cold email sequences just as a baseline then myself an entire sales team in a lot of cases would relentlessly call anybody who showed a flicker of interest or even had a pulse so approach two is simply everything from number one plus taking this action. So calls, leaving voicemails, at least doing something like video messages or voicemails on LinkedIn. You just remember like they're all these sales teams and all these recruiting agencies are doing 75 to 100 phone calls a day on top of all that automation. Approach number three is rare. These are a rare breed. It's just marketing and social selling. These are people that are adding connections on LinkedIn and putting content out there that has to do with hiring in that space, running Google ads, YouTube ads, setting webinars and talking about best hiring practices and then following up with those leads. They're running LinkedIn ads. They're making video content on YouTube, on LinkedIn. And this is a skill that takes time. It's a long-term investment, but it definitely pays off. So here's what I'm saying. Either pick up the phone, start making video voicemails, do something to grab attention outside of that automation. So like and subscribe for more. If you're a recruiter, a recruiting agency owner, go check out the Patreon. And it's only 14 bucks for all that content. RecruiterRocket.io, description below, all that good stuff.